Some of the best cookware available is made of stainless steel. It works great for searing and sauteing, but over time and without the right maintenance, they'll look their age. The ghosts of dinners past do not have to haunt your kitchen though. With the right cleaning methods, your stainless steel will look good as new for much longer. Hi, I'm Branson from Best Reviews. If you like content like this, give us a like, hit the notification bell, and subscribe so you don't miss a video from us. First off, let's answer the question on all of our minds. Why is it called stainless steel? If it stains. Stainless steel is actually the name of the metal alloy. It doesn't corrode, which means no rust stains whatsoever, but it can't avoid stains from regular use in the kitchen. Stainless steel is great at giving your food that browning effect you look for in certain recipes and can last a long time. It isn't the same as non-stick cookware, which is often made of Teflon and other coatings that keep food off but make the pan more delicate in the long run. No matter which material you're looking for, good cleaning practices work for all kinds of pots and pans you might have your eye on. Brands like Caraway, Carote, and Cuisinart specialize in both stainless steel and non-stick cookware. If you want to learn more about these pots and pans, check out the links in the comments below. No, you can't just let your stainless steel pan soak in the sink. You need to act quickly to get the best clean. Everyday cleanup of your favorite stainless steel cookware involves the basics. Hot water, dish soap, and a non-abrasive sponge can get most post-meal remains off. Let water sit in the bottom of the pan for a few minutes to get a head start on anything that might be tough to get off, like burnt on juices, scrambled eggs, fish. After you've cleaned what you can and they're still stuck on food, you'll wanna bring the heat, literally. Put the soap and water mixture on the stove, boil it for about 10 minutes, let the water cool, then bring it back to the sink. The mess will come off with a few easy rinses. If that doesn't work, try the baking soda method. Fill the pan with two tablespoons of baking soda and some water. Then boil it, cool it, and rinse with the help of a sponge or cloth. Long-term stains and discoloration can be tough, but not permanent. If you're looking at hard water stains, you'll see a chalky white buildup. Fill the pan with a mix of one part white vinegar and three parts water. Boil it on the stove and then rinse and wash as normal. If you're looking at dark stains that look like leftover food but much, much, much older, go through the vinegar and baking soda methods as many times as you need. Also give it the lemon juice treatment. Coat the bottom of the pan with lemon juice and let it sit, then scrub with a sponge. Final tips. One, don't let food sit. Stuck on food only gets stuck on when you leave it alone. So get it off before it's too late. The earlier, the better. Don't let the pan sit with water droplets either. Dry it right away. That's how you avoid water spots. Two, don't clean a hot pot. Always let your pans cool down before putting them under running water. If it's too hot, you could accidentally warp the metal, which could make the pan not sit right on the stove, and that's annoying. Speaking of hot, be careful of gas ranges. If you let the flames hit the underside, that can leave a burn mark that's extremely hard to get off. Always go low and slow. Three, don't stress. A couple of stains won't affect your pan's performance. Mistakes happen, and some of them are especially stubborn. So don't stress about getting that perfect stainless steel shine. As long as your pans are clean, you're good. So tell us, what's your favorite stainless steel cleaning hack? Have any tricks up your sleeve? Let us know what your thoughts are in the comments. Once again, I'm Branson from Best Reviews.